I have a weird true story to tell you. Last night in my haze as I was drifting in and out of sleep, I thought, what if Ant-Man just shrunk down to a microscopic size and went into the veins of Thanos and then um, messed up Thanos' brain? And then this today I read that there is actually a theory that... <laughs> you know this one, Paul? That Ant-Man will shrink down and go into Thanos' butt. Yeah. Right? It seems less effective. Yes, yes. And, uh, and by the way... It smells delicious. It it smells like me. Yeah. <laughs> it really does. Where is it, Chris? No. Oh. It's a mix of smells, you know? Oh. Scarlett, it was your idea for, what, the original six Avengers to become tattooed together? Um, yeah. yeah. I thought, if, well, I think Chris Evans and I kind of came up with it. Okay. And so Chris has it. Uh, you have it. Robert has it. Who else actually got it? We all have it, and then, but Mark does not have it. Mark yeah. Ruffalo does not have it. Yeah. He declined. I brought, I brought some uh, pictures. Scarlett never forgets. This year, she got me uh, oh, a lovely sweet. bouquet of my favorites, which are... Of sunflowers. Sunflowers, uh, yeah. Nice. Uh, that is nice. And then, because I'm the fourth and Paul's the sixth, I got him a, a little framed art piece. Did you like it? I loved it. it gorgeous. Really, 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 really nice. Oh. I was very touched. And Thank then you. I had gotten him that alpaca that he wanted, because that's his favorite animal. Oh, my gosh. Oh, you got Paul an alpaca. That was... That, was that, oh, really, wow. that really blew me away. I named him... I named him Dennis. Oh, Aww. he's got a bit of an attitude, but he's fun, and he, uh -huh. I, you know. On Friday, you guys were all at Disneyland. Um, Avengers made a huge donation to children's hospitals. Yeah, five million dollars. <laughs> and did you go on down any rides while you were there? Did you? Enjoy yeah, we did. We went on the Guardians of the Galaxy ride. Oh, you the, did? At the one that drops yeah. like crazy. We went on it. I don't know where were you. Where did you go? I didn't. I didn't. Well, I went. I was there uh, February seventh for my kid's birthday. We went on that ride, and I almost yacked. Oh, is that right? Yeah. So I was not going to do it, it again. It was I really. It was good. A couple of your people that worked for you. We went on the Guardians of the Galaxy ride oh, you the, did? at the one that drops yeah. like crazy. We went on it. I don't know where were you. Where did you go? I didn't. I didn't. Well, I went. I was there uh, February seventh for my kid's birthday. We went on that ride, and I almost yacked. Oh, is that right? Yeah, so I was only going to do it, it again. It was I'd really, it was good. A couple of your took, people that worked for you. My, like, yeah, my team came on it, but I took my daughter on it a couple of years ago when it was previously called the Tower of Terror, Tower of Terror. or something. And uh, she wasn't tall enough, and, and she was really upset. And I was like, nah, forget this. Come here. So I grabbed a couple of Snickers bars and things and slammed it in the back of her shoe <laughs> under her heel. When we were shooting Ragnarok, we had um, a young kid on set who was... Uh, who, who was uh, unwell at the time and had come to visit and um, and we were shooting the scene with Hulk and Thor in the arena and it was right when I was talking to the Hulk and I was saying oh my god it's you where have you been and I don't know and he was on the sideline he's like why don't you say uh, the, um, when you look up at, at Loki in the crowd so he's, a, he's a friend from work and then so that line a kid gave you that line? kid gave us that line yeah and, and became wow. one of the best lines and uh, she wasn't tall enough and, and she was really upset, and I was like, nah, forget this, come here. So I grabbed a couple of Snickers bars and things and slammed it in the back of her shoe <laughs> under her heel. So I, like, propped her up, because it's like this, my shot. Walked up, I was like, uh, what about now? So, and they're like, OK, in you come. <laughs> I'm like, so... <laughs> Snickers it gets worse, right? Well, you're anyway. responsible as well, and you're all, right, all it cheering. Worse, right? It gets okay, worse, go right? On. So we're sitting in the chair. <laughs> and this thing, it's, you know, I don't know how many hundreds of feet high or oh, whatever. Oh, We're at the yeah. top, and I'm looking at her, she's strapped in, and, the, you know, the seat is massive on her. And I'm like, you know, we beat the system, honey, well done. And then it drops, and she's like... <laughs> <laughs> grab on her, she's, like, screaming the whole way down, like... You know... I was like, May maybe there's a reason that there's a, a, a height... Maybe! Size. Yeah. So, so, don't do that, don't do that, she's fine. Boy, well, there are a lot of them, but the very, the very first time I filmed with these guys mm -hmm. on uh, Civil War, it was pretty spectacular because we'd already filmed Ant-Man, but that was a little bit in a bubble. And all of a sudden, I was seeing everybody in their suits, and it was very exciting. In fact, one time, Chris Evans, I was standing opposite him, and he had to run to use the bathroom or something, and he asked the prop guy to hold his shield. And uh, <laughs> as he walked off, I just said, can I, can I try it? And I, <laughs> I took the shield and uh, it was, yeah, it was, it was very exciting. It was not dissimilar to what my character was feeling in the scene. <laughs> what did you do with the shield while you had it? 